So guys, episode 6 of Ping Pong Girl has been, what we could say, a decent, well thought out, nice episode. It's this episode, takes, it takes a break from from all the first five matches that we had in Ping Pong Girl. And now in 6, it's just a day to take a break. Now this theme, in this episode, it, it talks about rubber. Yes, rubber. And it ain't talking about a condom, I'm talking about the paddle. Now, yes, the rubbery paddle, the rubber of it. Now, now I for one, was kind of funny at times, you know, think about it guys. They keep talking about rubber this, rubber that. Oh, your rubber's so thin. Oh, your rubber's so tight, all that stuff. And when you watch it, you see this funny, you get this funny thing going on like, oh, the perverts are talking about condoms. I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys were all thinking of it as y'all watch episode six. Now, yes, it does have some humor into it when they talk about the rubber. Still to this day, this episode, they keep talking about it. But another thing was interesting was not only about that, was also the fact that it, talk, it introduces two characters that we already know about and how they got into ping pong, Kokoro and Hana. Hana is the the energetic blonde haired girl keep messing up with with Kyori's hair a little pin to the tail and the other one is Hokuro who's the Kakashi lookalike like this and just talks now for one out of all the girls in ping pong girl she's like legit she's like I don't know about her but she's like my favorite character honestly like she's literally my favorite character of all by all time I mean just how <laughs> I love her personality. I love how she runs a family store full of ping pong, well, a, a ping pong shop, and that got her into ping pong in the first place. Not only that, her friend Hana, they just, it's just opened up to a point where why they are friends in the first place. And Hana Chan opened up to her because that even though she works alone in the store, it's not right for her. To have, you know, you gotta have somebody to help you run the store. That being said, she, Hana and Hokuro became best friends like that. Working at the store, going to school, playing tape, play ping pong. <sighs> friends it did. Now, another thing was, Kiori working at the store. Okay, think about it, Kiori working at the store. Do you know how crazy that is? I mean, she all shy and everything. And the thing, to see her working at the ping pong store, I would have been better if she were in a maid cafe, because think about it, she's all shy, clumsy. I mean, working in a maid cafe will be perfect for her. But in a ping pong store, uh-uh, not, not gonna happen. Now, and then, out of the blue, while Kyori working in a store, working out their opening, you know, putting out checks, giving them change, they met one of the craziest girls ever. And I'm not joking, she's crazy. She got those scary green eyes, bulk, bulk guys like this. Say, hello. See how creepy that is? She sound like she, she's just like from Corpus Party, Sajika, with those little, with those eyes bulked out. She's like, I'll take this, I'll take this. She's in that maid outfit with the green hair. She is so fucking scary though. I can't even like. I still when I first saw her, I'm like, this is for real. But. We now know that she's one of the players from the East, the elite, one of the elite four of the East. Because no, they didn't, they didn't open it. They didn't show you like, oh, it's her. The captain of the team saying, oh, let's not rest. Even though, even though we have a practice match, we're up against one of the elite four members, and one of them is from the East. And just like they already confirmed who's one of them, and it's the girl with the green hair and the maid outfit, psycho bitch. Yes, she's psycho. I mean. She's freaking scary. No wonder she's a badass. But anyway, this episode was pretty decent. It was well open for Hokuro. It was all about, it was all, this episode was about Hokuro herself. You know, having to talk like this, being all shy and everything, and made wonderful friends throughout the entire lifetime between her and Hana. So it was really great. And it was kind of funny with all the rubbers part. <sighs> still to this, till this episode was about rubber. Yeah. But, Again, this episode was decent. And next week, next week, we're back in action because they're up against one of the national, one of the champions, I mean, one of the teams who made it to the nationals. So we're gonna get hyped 
match. So everybody, grab your paper because we're about to swing in the competition.